Good morning, traders. John Caruso coming to you here for the morning of March 31st with your currency update for the morning. Uh, first, we're going to take a look. We did see consumer confidence come out here in the United States. We did see a blowout number. 101.30, the market was looking for 96. Uh, right now, the U.S. dollar, uh, it still holds the upper hand amongst global currencies. Right now, the uh, dollar is trading at 98.80. We're up 52 points on the morning, but be careful because we do have some significant resistance levels that are quickly approaching. Uh, we've got a resistance zone between 99 and 99.20. And then from there, the second level of resistance comes in about 99.46. Uh, looking at the euro currency right now, we're down 81 points, uh, 107.53 uh, the last time I looked. Uh, we do have critical support in the euro coming in at 107. Uh, if we do break 107, that will support uh, lower price action ahead. Uh, looking at the Japanese yen, uh, we did see some better housing numbers out of Japan in the overnight, uh, which is providing the yen with a little bit of a lift right now. We're at 83.45, up 16 points on the morning. Uh, the way you trade the Japanese markets here lately, uh, you got to remember that positive economic news in Japan is actually supportive for the yen and bearish for the Nikkei, their stock market over there. Uh, so try to trade accordingly uh, to that. Um, we're going to go on to uh, the British pound right now. British pound, we're, we're currently in a bearish cycle at the moment. However, it looks like we're trying to find some, some solid ground uh, down around 147.50. If that area can hold down there, that might uh, support some higher price action ahead. Uh, and, and, you know, the, the next upside target from 147.50, if it holds, would be upwards around 150. Um, looking ahead Friday, we do have the unemployment number out. Uh, the markets are going to remain yeah, I would suspect range bound until we hear we do hear from uh, the unemployment number. We're looking for a number of 247 uh, and a uh, uh, unchanged in the rate at five and a half percent. So uh, we'll see you then. Uh, trade accordingly. Once again, I'm John Caruso. Feel free to give me a call anytime. 800-669-5354. Futures and options on futures may involve substantial risk. It may not be suitable for all investors.